clouds, the big puffy masses in the sky sometimes when we drive or walk outside and see them in the air. They don't appear to be moving at all, just frozen in time. These masses of moisture and other things in the air look like they're just sitting. They won't move. On a windy day, you can see a little movement. It might be going one way, coming toward you. Hard to say. But when we take time and we create movement, we suddenly see the clouds come to life. We see multiple movements in different directions at different heights. And suddenly they breathe and they move and they look like they're racing, going somewhere, maybe nowhere at all. But suddenly they're in joy when you look. You see them for what they actually are, they're moving. But then again, this planet that we stand on, maybe we're the ones moving, and the clouds are standing still. Maybe it's a combination of both. Clouds are actually rotating and moving around the globe, and we're moving at the same time, which causes the directional changes that you see. We'll see higher up, in elevation, you'll see the clouds move in one direction, while down lower, they turn a different direction. So they look like they're contradicting each other in movement as they cross paths. Sometimes, if you look at these in movement, you'll see the clouds create and grow. You'll see them become huge masses in the sky as they blow up. Suddenly they'll let rain out at one point when it gets too heavy and too cold. But until then, what we see are constant changes in attitude, latitude, and where are they going? So next time, whether you're driving or just standing up soon, take a look up. See what direction they're going. You might actually see them go in different directions at the very same time. Clouds, don't ever take them for granted. They are there.